Hey guys, it's Christina. Um, I want to do a quick little video. I got a couple books in the mail today. So instead of dragging them over to my bed, I thought I would show you my bookshelf since it's much easier to show. Um, it's actually a bigger um, up on the top. My dad made this for me years ago. Um, I think I was either in middle school or, the, or junior high, so we're talking like um, 14 years ago maybe, I don't know. Anyway, it lights up in there so it shines through and it's all pretty. Um, anyway, this is my bookshelf. Um, what books did I get? Um, I got... Um, the first two in the Harry Potter series that I have not read. I actually read the first one, except for I think I read the second one. I'm not sure. When it first came out, back when I was like 14, um, I was probably even younger than that. I read one of them. You'd think it was the first one, but for some reason, I think it was the second one. But anyways, I'm going to reread them. I bought cheap ones off of Half.com for 75 cents to see... If I like them, I'm sure I will. Um, and then I plan on ordering them in hardcover, which I actually have a couple of them already on their way to me. Um, and then what else did I get? Um, I got four books. What did I get? Uh, oh, I got the... I got Betrayed, which is the second, and you can't even see it. The second book in the House of Night series, and like perfect conditions used by you to save the difference. That's the Dunker quote for any of you other nerds like me. Um, what's the other one? Oh, I got this huge monstrosity of a book, Beach Blondes. It's a bind up of three books. Um, I got it really cheap. I thought it would be a light, good. However, it's like over 700 pages. It's like one of the biggest books I've ever seen in my life. Um, it's huge, but I thought it would be a fun, easy read. It's Beach Blondes by Catherine Applegate. So, another quick little overview of my bookshelf. I know these books are all stacked up, but I have too many. And I use my lower ones as like, well... I have my scrapbooks over here, and that's kind of just like stuff piled, like my cake decorating books. And then I have more books. <laughs> Down there is my treasured series, and it goes all the way. I have some, well, here's some right here, but they are back there. And it goes to the whole shelf, and those, and they are all a series from when I was little. Like, um, there's even some stacked. Like, I was... I think I started reading them when I was about 11, and I remember it's like, um, there's got to be like, I don't know, 50 books. I don't know how many there are. At least 50, probably more than that. And I would beg my mother to buy them for me when I was little, because I loved, and they're all, it's, it's called the Love Story series. Um, and they're just little mass market paperbacks. And I, anyway, I am, like, afraid to get rid of those books because they meant so much to me when I was little, but I know now that it's silly for me to keep them, but I know I need someone special to give them to because I don't want to give them to some little teeny girl who's just going to be, like, destroy them because those were, like, my life growing up. But anyway, I have some more books, just stuff. But these are all my, all my books, and I just finished um, Divergent today. Um, I did a little bit of, I know I said I wasn't going to do homework today, but I did. I did a little homework, but that's okay. Just get me ahead of the game. When I finished Divergent, I read a lot um, last night. I stayed up way too late, like way too late reading this book because I was up until like 11 doing homework. And then I started reading and I couldn't put it down. And this book was so good, it like got my adrenaline pumping and then I couldn't sleep, so I just kept reading. But this book is amazing. 
by Veronica Roth. So, so good. And the guy in it, hmm. it's not, it's not, it has a little romance in it, but it's not a love story. Um, the, the romance kind of adds to the story, but it's not the main focus of the story. It's just a really good dystopian action. <laughs> it's just good. Anyway, um, I really like that. And then I also read The Summer I Turned Pretty the other day, which is the first in the... I don't know what this... The Summer Series by Jenny Han? I don't know what it is. Um, so I'm going to read those two. Right now I'm reading Perfect Chemistry on my Kindle. And I have the 13 Reasons Why I pulled out because I want to read it too. But there's only so much I can do since... I do have school and I do work full time, so yeah. Anyway, I'm done rambling now. This is six minutes when it was supposed to be like two. So thanks for watching and have a good night. Bye.